Hey guys, welcome back. I meant to do this video yesterday for WWE Backlash. Um, like I said, I was going to start doing a series. I think what I'm going to do, I know it may sound cheap or whatever, but I think I'm just going to, because I get, got really busy yesterday, so I'm go not going to stop doing the series. I'm not. I Instead, I'm actually going to do it the day after, but I'm still going to have my predictions. So for yesterday for Backlash 2016, let's get started. Kickoff show, we have Baron Corbin versus Apollo Crews, and I said that Baron Corbin was going to win. I got that correct. Uh, Hype Bros versus Usos, last, man, last chance match, and I said the Hype Bros are going to win, but the Usos won. So then we had Heath Slater and Rhino versus Hype Bros or Usos, and either way I said the... Um, that uh, Heath Slater and Rhino were going to win. And I got correct on that one. Um, Alexa Bliss in the six um, women pack challenge for the to the crown. A SmackDown Live women's champion. We had Alexa Bliss versus Carmella versus Becky Lynch versus Naomi versus Natalia versus Nikki Bella. I wanted Nikki Bella to win. I just felt like that should have happened. Now... Becky Lynch won, and I do got to admit, she does deserve it. Um, we saw Bray Wyatt attack Randy way, like, I don't know, like an hour before their match. Um, so Bray won by a forfeit, and then Kane came out and won with an RKO, and then after Randy came out and hit an RKO, Kane choke slams him, one, two, three, and they are burying Bray Wyatt, and I wish they wouldn't do that. They could have turned him into the next Undertaker, honestly. Um, we had Miz versus Dolph Ziggler, Intercontinental title. I wanted a new Intercontinental champion. I don't... I mean, I'm, my, Miz is good, honestly. He's good. Um, I'm just not really a big digging the Intercontinental championship reign anymore. I'm hoping Daniel Bryan does come back eventually and kicks his, kicks his butt. If he can. If he can. Um, but... I said Dolph Ziggler was going to win, but Miz won. Uh, Dean Ambrose versus AJ Styles, World WWE World Championship. I wanted Dean Ambrose to win, but except AJ Styles won. You know what? The phenomenal one has finally won his first championship. Now you just got to wait for the, club, the Luke Gowles and Anderson to win that. Win the tag team. But... I don't have really any problem with um, it just AJ Styles being champion. I like Dean Ambrose being champion. It's fun. So, so those was that was my predictions for the uh, show. Um, it was a good show. We got Clash of Champions September twenty fifth, and then I will be making a review video the twenty sixth. The next WWF pay-per-view on here will be October 31st, WWF Halloween Havoc. There is no September pay-per-view this year. Um, yeah, I mean, keep eyes out, people. Feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you all for watching, and I'm sorry about the delay. Yeah, delay. I was going to go by time, but I couldn't figure it out right now. Um... I know. I just know it's over twelve hours, um. So, or twenty four hours, something like that. Um. So that's basically it for this predictions. I'm gonna, like I said earlier in the beginning of this video, I'm gonna be doing this for the for the re remainder of the pay per views or whatever. I'm going to be doing predictions and the results in one video, one video. Um, the day following the pay-per-view. Um, this is only due to for school because I can't. I've been staying up too late and I cannot get up really or stay focused in school like I'm supposed to. So bear with me, guys. Um, we don't know when the next WWF video is. We just saw Mr. Anger shoes retire. Uh, so yeah. Please feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and please share on any type of social media. Do not do, not do anything that 
should not be done. Just share the videos. That would be great. Thank you very much. Have a good day.